I think some of the most exciting new work in the field of oncology are these high-risk, high-reward projects where you don't know what you're going to find. There are always new questions in the field. Because they're high risk, you're going to strike out many times, but every now and then you're going to get a home run. The healthcare system has been quite broken. I really think technology can help us to move the healthcare system to be more proactive. So our work aims to co-design and implement digital tools to improve the way we take care of cancer survivors, empowering patients to be more active in their care. We work on ovarian cancer, which is still a very deadly disease. Our goal is to make ovarian cancer more immunogenic and develop either single or combination therapies against this disease. One thing that's a privilege in working in the field of breast cancer is it's something that resonates with everyone. We are able to cure a vast majority of patients, but then we also have patients who have very advanced disease who really need cutting edge medical care and insights that scientists like myself can give. After having practiced in three different countries in a healthcare professional point of view, but also as a family member, I could see how alone patients were and how the information flow was actually broken. Our research focuses on targeting our own immune system to find and kill cancer cells. We discovered that treating cancer cells with drugs that open up the way the DNA is packaged causes transcription of old viruses in our genome. And when that happens, you activate a viral response in the cancer cell. And so this would kill the cancer cells and bring in the host immune cells to kill them too. Funding is important for a couple reasons. It is recognition that your ideas are exciting and have the potential to change the world. And also it gives you contact with a network of people that can help your research career as well. I was really honored to get the Gilead RSP to explore this project, but we've now been able to build on that and publish papers, get data that we can then use to apply for funding for a larger project. I think the RSP is enabling the future of scientific discovery because they're funding so many different scientists, and I think that that diversity is really exciting to keep the field going. I wish we could bottle that up for uh, how we teach science all across the country and encourage people to go into STEM fields.